Representatives of the Polish government, the Polish president and city of Warsaw, and delegations from both houses of the Polish parliament and others lay flowers at the Warsaw Ghetto Heroes Monument. Poland's chief rabbi, Michael Shudrych, said a prayer for the dead. People participated in the traditional daffodil campaign in which they wore yellow daffodil pins in remembrance of the uprising and took part in a march along the route of remembrance of Warsaw Ghetto Heroes. The uprising broke out on the 19th of April 1943, as the final phase of the ghetto's liquidation by the Nazis was taking place. The insurgency, which lasted until the 16th of May 1943, was a symbolic act as it had no chance of success. In an uneven struggle, the poorly armed fighters of the Jewish Combat Organization, or ZOB, and the Jewish Military Union took on the might of the SS and Wehrmacht forces, the security police and their auxiliaries. The uprising, which cost the lives of about 6,000 insurgents, ended on the 8th of May 1943, when its then commander, Mordecai Anilevich, together with a group of ZOB soldiers, committed suicide in a bunker at 18 Mua Street. Just a handful of fighters managed to escape from the burning ghetto through the sewers. Among them was the last commander of the uprising, Marek Edelman. <laughs> 